Hello everybody, conversation for today, your story matters, you matter. If you have a brand, if you have a service, if you have a product, well listen, the truth is people really don't buy those things because they just all of a sudden decide to buy your stuff that you're trying to sell. People really buy the why behind what you're selling, right? So if you represent a brand or you present a brand, people have to connect with that brand on some level. Same goes for your services and your products. People really want to know why you do what you do and don't please, please, please do not tell me that you don't have a story because everybody has a story. Look, if you've got pictures on your wall, see, I've got a whole bunch of pictures. This is a story of my life, some of my career, some of my family. If you have anything like this on your wall, you have a story. And if you don't, that means you haven't dug deep enough to actually find your story. You have a story, and I'm here to tell you that it matters. Not only does that matter, but you matter. It matters that you tell it. So on this Friday, I am challenging you to let your guard down, find yourself in a vulnerable place, and share your story because that is how you're going to connect with your audience. That's how you're gonna connect with people on a level that is much deeper, deeper, that creates loyalty and creates repeat clientele and repeat customers and people coming back for more. So just remember that when you are thinking about your mission statement and you're writing things down and you're trying to figure out how do I attract more clients, ask yourself, have you really shared a piece of yourself, a piece of why you do what you do with your audience? And if you come from that place, I'm telling you, you're gonna connect with people in a way that you've never connected before. So here's your challenge, share your story even better, tag it and comment it and share it on this post right below. All right, have a great one.